Okay, so something that's pretty important here that is really subtle and something you got to watch is can you see the difference between this door and this door? See, they're different, different depths. See? Well, that's kind of hard to understand for some, but they are. So this front one here will go in the front and then this one should go in the back, see? And then it gives it more space so that these can pass each other. And this is another reason why you should get a kit is because then you don't get confused and forget and just try and put those on. We're all human here, people, and we all make mistakes and we forget about little things like this. So it's best just to think and take your time if something isn't coming in right. Just let it go for a minute, do something else, or go get a cheeseburger and think about it for a minute. So what I'm going to do, it's kind of hard to, sh to actually physically show you with this, but I'm going to hang it on these here. And I hang the little wheels up in there. And if it doesn't want to go, just keep tilting the door, tilting the door, and eventually that little wheel should pop in there. As long as you've got a new part and a new thing. And that's mainly the thing with these is to, uh, if you've got the new parts, most of these problems will fix themselves a lot of times. Now down here, I would usually use these, but this is a concrete floor. And I would have to get concrete screws and it's a pain and, and these doors are really long and so I'm going to just try and just let the natural thing just kind of use it as a groove for now because it seems to be working. Uh, but this would go like that usually and then you screw it into a wood floor. I would have to screw it in the concrete and that's not fun. Most of the time people cut a little piece right here and they stick that up inside the carpet and uh, then that just holds the door so they don't move back and forth but these things are staying fine for a while so we're just going to let them be for a while until that wears in better and I can think about it a little more because the more you can think the more it goes so anyway that's where we're at at this point but uh, I know that seems simple but I'll tell you I've had some hard times with these things till I got them figured out and don't be ashamed. You're either hard, you're either a handyman because you're uh, smart, or you're one because you're stupid and persistent and probably Irish and can't don't know when to quit. That's why uh, handyman and alcoholics go together a lot of times. Talk to you soon.